up lovely? So I'm going to do a very brief tutorial on an all natural homemade hair mask that I make. The words might not go with the video too much, don't be alarmed, it's just how it's sped up. So what I use is some coconut milk, some extra virgin olive oil, honey, yogurt, and an egg. I normally use avocado but I haven't done that this time and that's up to you. You can choose to add it or not. I put it in a bowl and I mix it up and that's literally it. I then take my hair and I split it into two sections. One section gets put out the way, the other section gets split into two smaller sections and I just go ahead and I saturate the hair. I start with the back section, uh, making sure the scalp gets covered, the middle and the ends and I do the same with the front section and then I put those two together and I twist that up into a bun and that's my first section done. And then, surprise, surprise, I do the exact same thing with the other section. Um, it's pretty straightforward, really easy. It's not too messy, which I like, especially if you get your um, yogurt and coconut milk to be more creamy, um, which I prefer rather than a runny consistency. So I also use this on my face because it does the same thing for the face as it does for the hair. It hydrates it, it protects it, it really helps for smooth, lovely skin. So I like to use it on both my my skin and my um, hair so a face mask and a hair mask now after I am done I am gonna go and have a shower and I'm gonna put my products in my hair and do a co-wash and so I'm gonna come out and you can see my hair is about 50% dry it's got the products in it already but it's still bouncy it's still lovely and that's what I really like about the mask is it helps it to lock in that moisture and keep that for the rest of the week which is important for me and, and that's it that is my homemade hair mask it works like a charm um, just showing it when it's nearly dry and then the last bit is it completely dry um, it adds all the shine it makes my hair feel so luxurious and soft and I love to do this really regularly um, at least once a month but at the moment I'm doing it weekly and that's it my lovelies so if you've got any questions or comments you know what to do just leave them I'll get back to you ASAP and if you've got another DIY mix that you think is even better than this one let me know about it I want to try it out alright beauties I will be speaking to you soon bye